just 108. Birded it yesterday. One bounce and get it to stick. Beautiful. No problem at all. It's a birdie to start for Sam Horsfield. So immediately extending his lead from one to two. With this club, he shouldn't run out of fairway, even though this is pushed a little right, a little further right than he expected. That's a bad mistake. That's a long way back as well. And that's down the right wing and the rough is thickest, right where that's heading. They are both very different golfers. Third shot of horse fields at the par five third. And again, he's really, even, even a little bit downwind, you see he's getting a really good contact on that. A little bit of right to left, easy to miss it right and overcook it. No trouble at all. Two birdies in the first three holes for England's Sam Horsfield. He moves to 16 under and uh, at the moment he's three clear. With the humidity out here, the rough is juicy. He looks happy enough with it. And why wouldn't you be? The flag's over there on the left-hand side, and he needs to cover the bunkers. Coming slightly down, down breeze. This is a green light flag. Just with a nine iron. That's more like it, right at it again. That'll settle him down a bit. Slightly out of his right, a great chance. Gobbled up as well by Sam Horsfield, so drop shot at five. He bounces straight back at number six. And once again, he is two shots clear of the rest. Allowing for a jumper. This is risky. He wants to, this to come out like a rocket and maybe find the front left bunker. Let that go. Hoygaard's chipped out successfully. Just what you want. Does he fly it well up there? Or does he play a chunk and run and land it 15 feet short and release it out of it, out to it? That's how I see it. Just like that. I mean, he's, he's got a great short game action, whippy down at the ball with aggression. Down the slope, very fast. Finds the bottom of the hole, moves to 17 under, back-to-back -back birdies. Six and seven, good recovery out of that right side off the tee. You need to seriously finesse it if you're going to hold it up. Okay, good shot. Yeah. Gorgeous shot. Just a little hold up against it. Stalled up there. It's a good try. Oh, he's starting that left, cutting it left to right. You can only see half the fairway off the tee there. That's an absolute beauty. That Beautiful. was perfect, Richard, yeah. holding that off. Just with a nice eight up the hill. Get a wriggle on. Oh, we! I'll take that bounce. Go. Good chance to pump one in there to within 10 feet anyway. That's unlucky as well. Hit that upslope. Sam Horsfield at 10 for Birdie to stretch the lead again. Oh, and he's got it. 
and Horsfield. What a start to the back nine. Remember, this is where things started to go a little bit wrong for him. It's a brave play. Fine if it comes off, but don't run out right. Tee up quickly, and that's why straight down the middle of the fairway. Perfect to a part of the course that you can make a score on. Looks good for pace. This one, very good. That's a very nasty hole to get out the way. Baffy just bail out, don't even take the flag on here today. Just try to bail out with a high left to right fader. left all the way just pop it and let it slip down around the wall of death he's such a beautiful chipper so impressive around the greens okay man Pop a little bit no not this time just to five for sam horsfield he stays at 18 under. Two ahead of Dietrich. Three clear of Rasmus Hoygaard. Which is a good ploy. A zipping Lee Trevino fading style flight that. That's a beautiful shot. Proper shot. Coming down Breeze, which is a, a little issue. Oh, you're right. He scared it. What a beautiful shot. Sometimes it happens when you miss one on the last, same length. Just on the left edge. I hope I'm wrong. Wrong again. Doesn't have to happen that often, Wayne. And he's a big spinner of the ball. This horse field. Right there, another one with plenty of action on it. Funny enough, there's been eight, which is remarkable. It's playing above its par, though. It's the fourth hardest hole on the course. The stiffening draft. He doesn't mess about, I'll tell you. He gets over it and just plays at such a wonderful pace. Tester. Downhill. Got to be. He's going to move back to 17 under. That means Dietrich has a putt now to take the lead. Second bogey of the day for England's Sam Horsfield. Up his toll on the course next up as well. It's not going to be easy. Off a slight down slope. God, Sam. Go. I like that play. God. That's a good shot. I, I don't know what he's whinging about. That is a tough flag to get at. Okay, he's got a 40 footer, but it's dry. It is a gorgeous looking thing if it's the right weapon. Great oh, job. and it is. Excellent shot. That's Great an shot. absolute beauty there. Total courage there from Sam Horsfield. Yeah, if he does it, it may just seal the deal. Ooh. He's held these very well this week. He's had plenty of them inside left firm. Yeah, no problem. That was gutsy. That was clutch. You could almost see it. A little exhalation of breath as he picked the ball out of the hole. And Horsfield will walk to the 18th tee with a one-shot lead. I don't think he's going left. No, there it is. 
That'll do just fine. Yeah, long way from the hole, but it's putting. Go on, round you come. And stay there, pretty much where Oliver Farr was. I think he'll go round and mark that one. Have a few deep breaths. It's always difficult to tell from camera angles. We'll see in a second how far away that is. And Sam Horsfield has come of age. He has won for the first time on the European Tour. He is the 2020 Hero Open champion. Sam, you've dreamt of winning on the European Tour. That dream has just become a reality. Try and describe your emotions for me. I can't. It's, it's crazy. Yeah, I can't. Thomas Dietrich was trailing you, but he made four birdies in six holes from the 12th to catch you and then overtake you. What were your emotions? What were you thinking? What were you feeling coming down those last few holes, knowing how tight it was? Um, I made a bad bogey on 15, and then on 17, we wanted to, lay, we wanted to leave a good five-wood number. And I did 233 into and out to the left. And um, yeah, had a great shot there. And, yeah. European Tour are running their Golf for Good initiative. There's a charity element to this. You go to the top of the mini order of merit. If you stay there, you can donate 60,000 euros to your favorite charity. That would mean a lot, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would, yeah. Um, I didn't even know that until you just told me. But um, yeah, I'm just going to keep playing and yeah, see what happens. Don't get me wrong, it means nothing less at all. No. It's just different, isn't it? The new normal that we're all getting used to here. Ah, the sweet taste of success. To watch another European Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.